they just confiscated my drone hi guys welcome back to my channel and also welcome if it's your first time here before we start i just wanted to show you how beautiful this whale is in this video i'm gonna travel to marrakesh and i will share some daily experiences from there but also a demonstration of long exposure photography from Gemma Elfna Square. I hope I said it right. I hope you'll enjoy it and please consider to subscribe to my channel if you are enjoying what I do. And if you click the bell close to it, you'll get a notification every time I post a new video. So thank you for your time and enjoy the video. I've dedicated the last years traveling to some incredible places. I'm Alex Beldi and I'm a wildlife photographer. Beauty on our project is my personal tribute to our planet, where I hope through my photography to convey the beauty of the species and the place they have in our world and trying to help protect them but also show the impact we have on them and their habitat. The journey is long but quite incredible. If you ever wondered how some of my photographs were taken, oh well, the answer is hard work, tons of patience, incredible challenges in different environments, but a strong love for wildlife. These to mention only a few factors. Doing so, I had the privilege to meet incredible cultures. So now please come on a magical journey with me. Support my project by choosing a membership on Patreon. They just confiscated my drone, so there is no drone for this trip. And hopefully, they will just give it to me back. A place where I can go, and you be always mine, always mine. Ooh, always. Good morning, everyone. Uh, we are in Morocco and this is our first day here and yesterday at the airport they confiscated my drone so there will be no drone footage in this journey but hopefully they said they will give it to me back, back to me at the end so we'll see they gave me a sort of paper and they just kept my drone and I, I saw that the, um, the code is the same on my paper that it was sticked on the drone. So, I don't know, I will try to stay positive and just not let this negative thing uh, to have an impact on this journey. So this is a typical Moroccan breakfast and they serve it almost in every place. It consists in bread with delicious pancakes and marmalade, fresh orange juice and sometimes pomegranates. The tea is also very good and it is made with fresh mint but they have a large variety of teas here in Morocco. just arrived at the, a new hotel and it's really nice and stuff is really friendly also. Hey, how are you? Fine. Good to see you. Guys, you'll never believe this, but I have my own shop here.
market uh, around here and this is how they look Here we are in uh, Gemma Elfna here and this is uh, the square where we have some lunch and uh, they are preparing everything for, for the evening. Hey guys, so here I am in the Gemma Elfna Square in Marrakesh and I'm, doi I'm doing some uh, long exposure photography so basically the idea is to, to capture the still uh, subjects still, and then all the people that will move will have that silky effect Okay, so I really like this effect of the the long exposure because it really gives you the idea of the movement. Let's see the results. Hi guys, thanks a lot for watching and just to let you know that all the photographs from my page are available for printing and I will insert the link in the description below. Please subscribe to my channel if you are enjoying my video and please check the second part of this video where I will share some wildlife I was documenting in Marrakesh, some personal facts and opinions about the city and the locals and also some street photography. Thanks a lot for watching, see you in the next video, bye! Support my project by choosing a membership on Patreon. One last ticket before it's gone